just they're just smarter than, <laughs> than we were back in the day. I'm using it now though, Shivani. Anything I can do to get a victory around here. Yeah, I know. Trust oh, being a big issue. Oh. Side else up to the outside. Oh. And, oh. Jay White. Oh, this. Oh, oh. Jay White feigning injury, Brilliant. allowing Austin Gunn to take a cheap shot on Matt Seidel. Brilliant move from Jay White here. But he could also, he could really be hurt. Oh, for, you really he believe needs, that? He needs help. He's really hurt. I mean, you, you said Matt Seidel's knee is hurt. Why couldn't Jay White's knee be hurt as well? Well, he seems to have had a miraculous recovery if that was the case. And now Jay White. Again, looking for the cover. Two and... He's a different breed. He's part of the Commonwealth. We're much stronger people than Americans. What the hell did he just say? Uh, the British Commonwealth, Canada, okay, New Zealand. It. Yes. They consider yourself we. We. You're not from Great Britain. I'm from Canada. It's part of the Commonwealth. Commonwealth. You dope. You okay. dope. Jeez, Shivani. Jeez, Shivani. You were born in New York, you dumbass. Oh, just, I got a Canadian passport. I can claim both sides. Oh. Stop. Look at Jay White just carrying Seidel around by his neck. It's kind of like this more vicious version of a Gory Guerrero Especial. Now snap suplex. Do you see how Jay White put his foot in front of Seidel's head to prevent him from rolling out that cover? See, that's a very smart... For a guy, he's a veteran, even though he's only been wrestling for, I don't know, 10 years. You probably know more than I do. But that was a very veteran move he just did to stop Seidel from escaping out the, out the under, under the bottom rope. Yeah, Seidel definitely with the experience advantage over Jay White, but Jay White wrestling well beyond his years. And now the dragon oh, screw. Oh, the same leg, too. That dragon screw leg whip. Aubrey Edwards getting right up to Matt Seidel, asking if he can continue. And Chris, you felt that dragon screw. I mean, that just tears apart your knee. It's a very vicious move because obviously it bends the knee in a way it shouldn't go. Very much uh, used in Japan, probably more than, than here. But man, when you take one, you feel it. And we're talking about hurt knees. That just hurts Seidel even worse. It's a torque, and then all of a sudden it stops cold, right? Well, of course. Yeah. You know, move pioneered by the, the dragon himself, Tatsumi Fujinami, as Jay White in control of Matt Seidel. Our main event continues tonight on Rampage. Jay White in the driver's seat, Matt Seidel looking for an opportunity to fight back, but he has not been given many, Tony. No, I, I, Jay White has just absolutely smothered him in this match. And we're seeing Jay White, big, big axe handle blow that time. Oh, God. And Chris, I mean, not only has Jay White been smothering Matt Seidel, but Colton and Austin Gunn have played a role in this match. Well, they're insufferable. But look how White has his hands locked under Matt's chin. There was no escape from that chin lock, as we say. It's much more than that, though. Nope, Seidel rolls through. Wow, knee strike. nice. Caught Jay White unawares. Swinging a miss. And Seidel throwing his whole body into that kick. But he's feeling it. Look at him holding that knee, that injured knee that we talked about during the break. Took a vicious dragon screw from Jay White. And Matt Seidel hasn't been the same since. And not only that, Seidel, you could see the marks on his chest from Jay White here. Yeah, Jay White, very heavy handed and very hard hitter. But Seidel, a very hard kicker. As Jay White is finding out. The educated feet, as some might say. Now Seidel. He saw Jay White cover up top, so he went low, going after the knee. Wow. The question mark kick. Nice. Side out, connects, goes over, and Jay oh. White now able to kick out. The question mark kick, I love it. The guns almost got in the ring that time, they were so scared. They're gonna have to pretty soon to save the day if Matt Seidel keeps this going. Side out, can he power through this? He likes that high flying offense. But Seidel, it's the cornerstone of his offense, besides those kicks. Oh, well, oh he came down flat-footed, and that may have jammed his knee. Yeah, the guns helped to Jay out that time by letting me know what was going on up top. Oh, Seidel! Oh. Oh. Counters the DDT. Now the far leg hooked, and oh. Jay 
White able to kick out. Once again, Jay White, former IWGP world champion versus Matt Sedell. Both these men at the limit. Both of them have hurt knees. And both of them want this victory big time tonight here on Rampage. We have had a great Rampage. We really have top to bottom. We got three oh, hours tomorrow night live here on TNT. That's right, collision immediately followed by Battle of the Belts tomorrow night beginning at 8 p.m. Eastern. Live right here on TNT as Matt Seidel rolls up Jay White. Bridges back and Jay White, all of his weight bridging over Jay White's upper body, but he's still able to kick out. White spikes him with the Urinage. Two, and three. Oh no, Seidel, still alive. Great competition, really is. Great competitive match. Very much reminds me of a New Japan style match. No bells and whistles here, just two guys beating the hell out of each other in the best possible way. Jay White may have been thinking that sleeper suplex. He had Seidel locked up, but Seidel elbowing his way out of it. And now, there it is. Oh, no. Wow. No. on his feet. That agility, second and none. Oh, the roundhouse avoided. Blade Runner avoided by Seidel. Oh, oh reverse wow. Rada, but Jay White, yeah, crashing down on the back of his head. Seidel's going back up top again. Can he, can he connect this time? Can Matt Seidel take advantage of this opening? He's perched on top, Jay White to his feet. The Meteora, oh, no, step back. Jay White steps back, Blade Runner! One, two, three. Wow. Here is your winner, two-inch blade, Jay White. We saw an example of Excalibur and the Chris of how good Jay White really is right there. He waited until Matt Sedell jumped, took a simple step backwards, and was able to connect yeah. with that Blade Runner. An amazing athlete. We talked about it at the very beginning of the match. It's that counter wrestling of Jay White. It's that defensive wrestling, able to anticipate his opponent's next move and take advantage and swing things in his favor, which he did in a very big way. Well, fans, thank you very much for joining us tonight on Rampage. We will see you live tomorrow night, 8, 7 Central on TNT for Collision and Battle of the Belts 10. Three straight hours, live tomorrow night on TNT.